I'm Suzanne De Laurentiis. I'm 56 years old. I'm an independent film and television producer, and I have POTS syndrome. I can remember four years ago getting a really bad respiratory flu. It seemed like it went on forever. And then after that, I started having all these weird, strange symptoms. I got lightheaded when I stood up. My heart rate was sky high. I couldn't digest any food. My body was always overheating. I went to so many doctors. and Nobody knew what was wrong with me. I finally found a cardiologist that gave me a diagnosis of POTS syndrome. However, there wasn't a whole lot I could do about it. I took an experimental drug called Coiliner, which has helped me, but the symptoms were extremely difficult. At one point, I was bedridden. I couldn't stand up without passing out. My body was constantly overheating. I couldn't digest any food. I just felt horrible and depressed and felt really hopeless. And then I thought, well, it is a nervous system disease. So I had to say to myself, I'm either gonna do it or I'm gonna stay in bed. So I decided I'm gonna get out of bed. If I felt bad, I laid down. I started exercising really slowly and eventually I started to get back on my feet. I was able to digest food a little better. So I still had to drink a gallon of water a day or carry around a face scan, but at least I was out of bed. And I think that's so important for people with POTS syndrome. You have to accept now that you're not going to be exactly the way you were before. You're just going to be a different version of yourself. And you can do it. I did it. You can do it too. You have to get out of bed no matter how bad you feel. Even though today is difficult, tomorrow might be better. I like my abbreviation for POTS syndrome to be positive outlook on tomorrow. And I, I hope at some point I can be an inspiration for other people that are just struggling with this illness on a day-to-day -day basis. You will get better. You will.